Hey everyone, welcome back. Each week I've decided to start posting these new small one-off videos to help you understand some of the small code snippets that are out there. These are things that in the past I found myself looking for as a solution to smaller problems. This is going to be the first of those videos. For this video, I'll show you how to gather all the links on your site and allow them to open in a new tab. If you're looking for a way to open all the internal links on your site in the same tab, but you want to open all external links in a new tab, you should see a card pop up at the end of this video for that. So here we have a series of links on our page and you may have one site with a few pages or you may have many sites with many pages. Sometimes it's useful to send users off your site when they click on a link. In this video, we're gonna gather all of those links for the site and apply the value of blank to the target attribute. So here I have some basic HTML. I've styled the links to uh, so that you'll be able to see them. Uh, and I've added this um, button here to uh, give an example of a form. Now, one option that you have for sending your all of your links into a new tab is simply applying the, uh, the target attribute um, by hard coding it in. And you can do that like this. Okay, and it adds the target blank so that when I click on the, the Microsoft link, it will open in a new tab. If I remove this and I click on it, it will open in this tab, the same tab that we're on right now. You have you also have an option of setting a, uh, a base tag up here in your meta tags where you set base target Like that and what that will do is it will open all links in a new tab like this but it will also look at uh, it, will, it will also consider the button targets to be the same type of target so any click submission it will open in a new tab which is not always the most friendly way to operate your website so if you do decide to do this you're going to have to include some custom javascript to avoid uh, form submissions now the way i'm going to show you how to do this is by collecting all of the links putting them into an uh, a node list and we're going to basically sort through them. We're going to iterate over them. Okay. And for that, we're going to collect all the links. So we're going to let links equal document dot query selector all. And we're going to grab the a selector. And then we're going to take that variable and we're going to put it into a for each. And this will loop over all of the links. So basically what we're saying is that for each um, anchor element, we're going to write a function. And that function is going to take each one of those links and we're going to add an event listener, a click event listener. And we'll add an anonymous function. And we're going to set the attribute of each one of those links. The target attribute. We're going to set that to blank. And let's terminate these lines here. And now if I click on any one of these, it's going to open in a new tab automatically. This is very helpful if you have maybe hundreds of links in your site. Uh, you want one easy way to target them all and have all of the links open into a, uh, a new tab. Uh, this will also not force a, a submit button to open in a new tab, which uh, will help with your uh, user experience as well. Anyways, I hope this video helped you. 
Uh, please leave your comments below uh, and like and subscribe uh, for more videos to come.